Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kenna Daniel, the founder of the Investiva Movement. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your friends. On Wednesday, we found out that the U.S. new home sales surged to a two and a half year high in January. U.S. crude dropped below $50 as the coronavirus spread in the Middle East and in the Eurozone. Fed's Kaplan said it's unclear right now if coronavirus calls for a U.S. rate change and that it may be too early for the ECB to contemplate a coronavirus response. On Thursday, we keep an eye on the virus while awaiting the U.S. GDP and durable goods orders. Today, I'm looking at the CAD yen pair, which has just confirmed below the daily Ichimoku cloud. The future cloud is a bit mixed at the moment, but uh, the, the pair has also formed a double top bearish reversal chart pattern, which indicated that we could see further drops towards 82.23 and 81.49 respectively at the very least. Do you think the CAD yen pair will bounce back or continue down? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tick Mill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.